Hello, all you lovely people out there in the land of the tube of yous. It's me, that gaming nerd John, and we're continuing our journey through Chrono Cross, the Radical Dreamers edition. We have just defeated Lynx as Shadow, as he taunts us. So we'll dive right in. Poof! Why, just a mere shadow of mine is enough to deal with the likes of you. Now, Serge, what do you desire from this world? Do you wish to live again? Do you want to erase your demise from the pages of history? What's wrong, Serge? Oh, that ringing in my head. That seems normal. Listen to me. The end of the human world is nigh. When this time comes, Serge, there shall be a deep enmity between you and the world. This is not speculation or prediction. This is history. Uh-oh. Bugger, this doesn't look good. You cannot escape. There is something I want to ask you. Daddy, about that voyage I have been planning. Opportunity knocks! Oh my. Don't make, don't move a whisker if you want this girl to live. Goodness gracious, who are you? My darling Riddell, why you dirty? Shut up, old timer. Our lives are at stake here. There ain't nothing dirty about saving your own skin. Well, just stay calm and quiet. I won't hurt you, okay? I just need you to come with us till we reach a safer place. Good girl. You all right, Serge? Come on, let's bust out of here. Yeah, I'm, f I'm fine. I just... I just saw a building in the middle of the sea, like, explode. And then there was, like, a giant flamey crystal thing. And I don't know. I'm questioning a lot of stuff right now. Don't be foolish. Do you really think you can escape? Oh, Shibata bread. We're blocked in. You fiend. Take your dirty hands off Lady Riddell. Yes, sir. Three bags full, sir. As if. What do you take me for, a bloody idiot? Grrrr, Karsh. Search this way. Hup, 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 Yo, I gotta say, the Lynx got style, man. That is an outfit. I could never pull that off. We have you now, you vermin. There's no way out of here. Bloody hell. Let's work out a deal. Release my daughter, and I shall let you walk away. How about it? Yeah, right. As if we can trust you. Are you willing to jump to your death? No! Look out! Ugh. Shit! What do you live for? What are you willing to die for? I've been waiting for you, Serge. Waiting a long, long time. Now come to me, Serge, the assassin of time. The Chrono Trigger! He said it. He said the words. Pack it up. 
Come to me, Surge. Join me, and together... Oh. No, no! Woo! Good thing we landed on these hard rocks that wouldn't have shattered our bones to pieces. Oh, okay, we jumped into the water. Got it. Got it. That makes much more sense. Excuse? Okay. So, just because I kind of know what's about to happen here, we're just going to do one of these deals. You're finally awake, if you're looking for your friends, they're outside. Thanks, lady! Wow, you have a great tan. Did you get a good night's rest? You can go outside through that door. Go say hi to your friends. Oh, what if I climbed up? No, no, not that way. You go this way to get out. Damn. I have but one choice. I'm forced to do this. Oi, Serge, you finally woke up, eh? Give your thanks to Korcha. He's the one that saved us after we fell off the cliff. No sweat. It's all part of my job as a ferryman. But I have to admit, you caught me by surprise when you came falling from the sky. You're lucky that it was the sea that you fell into and not the rocks. But Jays, you're such a wuss. How could you get knocked out from such a short fall? As for me, a little graze like this ain't gonna knock me... Uh, oh man, she's burning up. There's a clinic in this village. We should take her there. Come on, I need your help. And Pierre stands there useless. Which is thematically appropriate. Hey look, we're coming up on another major decision. And this one's going to be spicy. It seems the patient has been poisoned with hydrovenom. I would say the most she has lives about two days. If we had some Hydra humor, we would be able to neutralize the poison. Doc, if we find this Hydra humor, we can save this girl? Yes, but that's impossible now. Hydras are now extinct on El Mido. Shit! What do you mean, extinct? What's going on? Hydras are very rare and valuable creatures. The blood, bones, meat, every part is valuable considered to be a panacea for various illnesses. That is the reason hydras were hunted to extinction in El Nido. As a result, a whole species has been made extinct, and all just to make a quick fortune. Is there no way to find this humor? If we could cross the sea to the mainland, there might be a chance, right? That is not possible. The currents of El Nido are extremely dangerous this time of year. It would be futile to try to cross the sea unless you were on a large vessel. Even if you manage to get there, your chances of finding Hydra humor are bleak. We do not have much time. Doctor? Life sucks, man. Hey, hey, Doc. Where are you going? Nothing's been resolved yet. Excuse me. I need to be alone for a while. Oof. Serge, what are we going to do? Kid is going to die if we leave her like this. Correct! Is this some kind of joke? Wait right here. I'll go, I'll go get the doctor back. Good luck with that. Whoa! Poof. Who the hell are you? What's this? Non apologies for bumping into moi. Ooh la la, don't you know any manners? Hey! <laughs> She's down for the count, just as I thought. Serge, 
Mono, why don't we just leave her be? Who are you? What's with that strange costume? These are all valid and good questions. Satan, I have no business with no chicken hawk. I am having a conversation with Serge. You're bothering moi, so keep your mouth shut. Why, you? I ain't gonna let you barge into this room and get away with all that stuff you just said. You made me mad. I'll show you some manners. I'm not gonna cut you any slack just because you're a girl. Try if you dare. I am not so weak as to be caught by a chicken hawk. Heh, you got some nerve. You're gonna regret it. Charge! Warm. Oops. Damn it, where'd she go? <laughs> You're amusing. <laughs> Such a simpleton. It's so much fun playing jokes on you. I was only here to see how she was doing, but I had fun while I was at it. So long, Serge. Au revoir, mon ami. Please dream of moi every night. Oui? She's a loon. What's her deal? I just don't get it. Yo, Serge, are all of your friends like that? <sighs> yes. Ugh, Serge. I'm dying, mate. Here, take my money. Come on, go talk to her. No, I'm scared. I don't want to. Serge, aren't you going to see kid? Uh, what you doing? Hurry up and go show her your face. Even when she is suffering from a high fever, she is worrying about you, Serge. Yeah, see, this is that awkward human emotion thing. I'm not so good with it. Like, I don't even know if this is the reality I'm supposed to be a part of. I mean, I've just been told I'm all sorts of things, like a chrono trigger and an, and an assassin of time. I mean, I don't even know what's going on. Okay, I'll talk to her. Serge, I'll leave this with you. It's my favorite amulet. Surge received astral amulet. Sounds important. Remember what the prophet said, Surge. Where did it all start? Where do angels lose their way? Try to remember, Surge. I'm feeling a bit tired. I'm going to rest up for a while. She did. You heard what the doc said. There's no more hydras in this world. On top of that, there's no way to get to the mainland, and El Mito isn't that small a place. Are you going to take a one in a million chance to search for this thing just to save a girl you barely even know? Hmm. Hey, what you going to do? Okay, so. The unfortunate consequence of this game is that this is one of those moral conundrums that kind of ties into a major plot point in the story. Uh, it's also one of the bigger choices in the game. So, depending on who you want to recruit is a big part of who you want to pick um, in terms of the choice made here. So, are you going to try to find a way to save Kid? Or are you going to go, that's crazy talk? Um, now, a lot of folks will probably, on their first playthrough, pick Save Kid. Makes sense. Thematically, it, it all ties up with the fact that, like, you have seen that you can cross the borders between dimensions and that you can uh, kind of get access to different, uh, different areas. So, that being said, though, there is one small thing to keep in mind. And that's the whole matter of uh, who you can recruit. So, uh, because of that, uh, I am going to keep in mind that I think, if memory serves, uh, you have to uh, basically give up on... Uh, on saving kid if uh, if you want to get certain characters and if memory serves one of them is Glenn yep okay just checking on the internets and things like that uh yeah I thought I remember that so we're gonna be awful people because Glenn is phenomenally strong uh so yeah I don't know hey wait a minute 
She's your partner, ain't she? Aren't you gonna do anything? No! There's nothing we can do. Hold it right there. You got no right to keep that girl's amulet. Leave that thing here. You're right. I'm useless. What's wrong? Hurry it up. Surge handed over the astral amulet. So now I can't go between the dimensions yet. Yeah. Yeah. It's, this is disgusting. It's turning out to be a bad day. Bye, Korcha. Don't hate me forever, even though you totally will. Ooh. Okay. So Lena's back in the party. And Poshul's... What? No. What? And Poshul's back in the party. And Lena's back in the party. Cool. Okay. Yeah. I feel like this will probably... Jeez, I'm missing so many elements. Ugh. Wait, can I? Yeah, I didn't think so. I was like, can I swap them out? No. New game plus only. There's so many things they gave you. So. Alright, now we can finally get rid of the elements that Pierre had. What did he have? Oh, he just had the ivory helmet. I got plenty of those. We're fine. All right, push all. Back in the game. Ivory helmet. Silver loop. His hit percentage or her hit percentage is god awful. Uh, knee pad. Or do I make her super beefy? Ooh. Tempting, but I'm going to go with the silver pendant to balance out the stats. All right. Oh, pff, copper mail. Hands down. Yeah, that's unfortunate, but yeah. Uh, we'll go with a copper helmet. Give her some better defense. Magic ring, because duh. Um, and actually, yeah, I like that idea. The silver earring for right now. Give her more HP. So that she's actually, like, not garbage. Cool. Okay. Uh, so, auto-allocate. We're going to go with Poshul and Lena individually. So let's see what it did here. Blue and green. Okay. One magma bomb. One arrow saucer. Why not swap out an ice lance at that high a level? Okay, tablet is cute, but stupid. Oh, God. Wow. Yeah, aqua beam. Okay. Uh, electro jolt, electro jolt, that all makes sense. Uh, but, let's do a heal here. Yeah, cur capsule is dumb. We'll go with an electro jolt. Magnify minus two. Wow. Really? Really? I'll go with Magma Bomb. Man, I need some more stinking elements. Wow. Oh, jeez. He doesn't even have... Yikes. I... I mean... A, the Arrow Saucer, I guess. Cover all Electro Bolt. So he has Electro Bolt. I think I'm going to give him a heal plus two. And then give him her. I'm gonna make that mistake all the time. Electric bolt. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, No, I feel better about that. Okay, cool. So we got my team. Alright. Big oofs. So again, the reason I made that decision is to get a couple of different characters. Glenn being number one. Uh, number two is Doc, who is a really good white element. Yeah. And she just doesn't say anything. But understandable if most people choose to save Kid. Uh, again, this is a game that's really good with New Game Plus because of just how much you get out of it. You there, girl. 
Trade you materials for your extra elements? Huh? So... I don't have any carapace right now. So that's something to keep in mind. Leather or eyeballs. No, I'm good. Thank you. I'll do it. Pelvic bone. Yeah, you need guts to get through life. Hey, that's right. My favorite dish is Terminus famous squid gut pasta. Cool. You there? Equipment, huh? Upgrade equipment. Yeah, let's take a look-see here. Mm. Copper sword. Okay. I don't have a carapace, though. So that's unfortunate. Don't have leather. Seeing a trend here. So I do have some copper. I can make one more copper mail which I think I'm okay with um yeah accessories copper helmet that seems a little unnecessary yeah we got it though knee pad would give me some leather Goon's honor, not in a million years. Yeah, nope. It's interesting that silver gives you copper. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah. Ugh, oh, silver iron gives you iron. Ay ay ay. Nope. I've got a ton of these ivory mails, but they don't give me anything useful. Like the iron vest, copper mail. Yeah. Okay. So. Equip Copper Mail. 15 defense. Still doesn't even get close to surge. Gee, many crickets. Yo, wait a minute. Lesser Pin Dragon Seal changes weapon element to that of the last element attack received. Oh. I forgot completely about that. Yeah, you know. Hmm. So basically, it's like magic sword oof buddy simmer down there simmer down with that hate okay okay talking about marble being a home for demi humans shiny material elements are common items nowadays but there's a special kind called summon elements this kind releases awesome power based on one of the six attributes. Shiny material is a mysterious byproduct of this phenomenon. The material is an essential item for craftsmen to forge advanced weapons, armor, and accessories. Still, everything depends on the skill of the craftsman. Hint, hint. Top tier. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Sad times ahead. Another life is about to slip through my hands, just like before. Studying medicine changed nothing at all. Man, I am so powerless. So you're going to just give up on this life? That's not the case, is it? If you do, who else will help her back from the edge of life and death? I don't know your past. Living bound by the past is a very painful thing. You need to face reality head on. Running away isn't a sin, but it accomplishes nothing. But I... One thing is different from the past. You have the ability to heal. Everyone in the village recognizes that. Don't suffer by yourself. If you give up now, you will never be freed from your past. Now go. Don't let it end without doing something first. I have done them a discourtesy. I am a failure as a doctor, but I must do what I can. Thanks, Orla. Can I, can I, let's not go in right now. Okay. <sighs>
game. <laughs> Let's not do that just yet. Uh, hello, people. We're a small village, but we have some rare elements you won't find in a bigger town. Let me take a look and examine that for myself. Hello, what do we got here? Photon ray. Ooh, I do like that. Okay, so we got a ton of money. So we can kind of grab a, at least a handful of these guys. Yeah, gravity blow. Hell soul is an instant kill ability and I found that those just don't work all that often so we're not gonna grab any of those guys but oh I've already got 47 tablets I think we're good. uh brace yeah I'll go up to an even 10 minimum of three for the rest yeah that's fine cool cool as a man at sea you gotta be on your toes whether you're on the land or manning the ship Rain attribute. There's a village, Mabul, home to us demi humans, but my friends there hate humans. Rough. It's probably because we're jerks. If I had to, you know, just hazard a guess. Such peaceful music, though. La -da 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 -da. Child! Say, have you ever heard of the six dragons? In this world, there's supposedly six dragon gods. The six great dragons descend from the heavens to seal away evil and promise eternal prosperity across the land. It's part of an old song that's been passed down in Il Nido for a long time. I wonder what they look like. Ah, eh, we'll never find out. Chief Diria is in prayer. You may not enter the shrine now. Come back a little later. It shouldn't be that long. Okay. Thanks. For nothing. Okay, so we got some new elements. We've abandoned our principles. I mean, our companions. To the north of this village lies Earth Dragon Isle, what we, which we locals call the land where the dragon sleeps. Until a few years ago, the surface was covered with sand, but somehow the sand disappeared completely overnight. Hmm. Nope. Doesn't seem suspicious at all. There's Korcha. He's probably pissed as hell at us. What do you want? You need something from me? I don't want nothing to do with you. Get out of here. You've got something to say? I need to borrow your boat. Lend you my boat? Ha! Huh, no way! Why should I lend you my boat? Sorry, pal. Go find someone else. Hold it right there. Oof. Mama's coming in. Is she mad? Mama? Why are you here? You said you were going shopping. Don't you start arguing with me. Aren't you going to help your friends when they need you? I thought you were acting strange when you came home, but I don't remember raising my son to be so inconsiderate. Bullshit! Oh, leave me alone. These guys ain't no friends of mine. It's none of your business anyway, Ma. Why should I lend my boat to guys who abandon their own partners? Hey, wait a sec. After overhearing that, I can't let you give up on your partners. Hmm, I don't see that blonde girl in red. What happened to her? She's dead. So, what's going on? I'd like you to tell this old lady your story. Blah, 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 blah. I see. So that's why she isn't here. That explains why you were upset when you came back. You're a helpless boy, aren't you? This boy only said he doesn't know what to do. Don't you think that's a natural response? You were just saying that out of spite. What would you have done if you were in his shoes? Come on, speak up, Korcha. Yeah, um, well... You see? You're just the same. Now apologize to this boy. Never! Oh, sorry about that. I just lost my temper. Good, that's settled. Now that you understand, go help these kids out. Hey, that's a completely different story, Ma. I can't lend them a boat. Don't be such a miser. Just lend them a boat or two. Or two! If you're so worried about the boat, just tag along with them. It's that simple, Korcha. You say a boat or two, but that's the only one I have. Besides, I don't know these guys from... You're such a blockhead. Fine, I'll borrow the boat. You never stay put, so it's a good time to do your chores. Go take care of Mel while you're at it. Do you understand? This is bullshit. Oh, God, you gotta be kidding. Now, what is your name, young man? 
Your name is Serge. Okay then, Serge. Nice to meet you. My name's Matcha. You can call me Ma or Matcha or whatever you like. I'll be waiting at the docks. Call me when you're ready to leave the village. By the way, Serge, you should go see the shaman. You look like you're lost. She might be able to help you get back on the path. Bye, Ma. Oops, I almost forgot. I came back to get some things I left behind. Okay, Serge, call me when you're ready to go. This isn't anything special, but go ahead and keep it. You know what frames are, right? This frame is called Tropical Paradise. Yo! Sup? Tropical Paradise frame? That one's busy as hell. But I guess we gotta switch to it. Sick! Cool. Alright. Window frame... Arnian Woods, Simple Line, Shellfish, Tropical Paradise. Look at that. It is. Look at how vibrant it is. Yeah, we'll use that for a little bit. I might switch back to T for 3 after a while. Let's see what that looks like. Don't get me wrong. I'm only lending you the boat because Ma said to. Oof. Okay. Cool. All right. Neat. Progress. Lots of progress. So... Uh, we have uh, successfully abandoned our friend. Uh, just kidding. So, um, leaving Kid uh, to the whims of fate. Uh, Doc going into a depressive spiral. Hooray. Uh, Korcha getting pissed at us. Hooray. Uh, but Matcha seems like she's going to join the team and, and ride a boat around with us. So there's that. And we got a new frame. Hooray. And, and new elements. I'll have to equip those. Um, a little bit of new equipment that we were able to kind of finally take a look at after uh, getting through Viper Manor. So big plots going through here. So surviving Viper Manor. Now we are stuck in Marbul with a boat to get us out. And uh, yeah, we'll see where it goes from here. Looking forward to acquiring some new compadres and continuing on our journey as we figure out what in the heck we're gonna do now and i am a rich bee anyway well hope you're enjoying if you are don't forget to hit that like and subscribe as well as that little bell notification that way you are kept up to date on all this amazingly relaxing content with absolutely no stressors involved at all thanks as always thanks again for watching hope you're enjoying and until next time take it easy